Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. My name is Left Handed Link. You could all do me a great favor by um, liking this video, subscribing to my channel, and um, hitting that notification bell so that you'll know when the next one of my episodes hits. Now, let's see what we're going to do this time. Um, I was kind of liked to go by certain songs that I like, so, um, you know, with that said, sometimes I may end up making, you know, picking a song where guys are like, dude, this guy's such a loser, but, you know, it's my choice, <laughs> so, I'm sure that there's plenty of friends of mine who would be like, that song, man, you suck, it's like, I may suck, I may just suck when it comes to picking songs, but trust me, when we're in tournament mode, I don't suck so much then. So anyways, with that said, um, hmm. I think that I'm kind of been gravitating towards the Donkey Kong levels. I don't know if I want to go to the Jungle Japes one or the original N64 one. Really not a big fan of the, uh, the Congo Falls because it's just complete and total chaos and I like being able to fight like symmetrically which I mean meaning by that that basically I'm standing on the same like level of somebody on the other side of the stage as you can see there's certain um the platforms on top they're not even ones like they're kind of staggered so you can't really do too much of a good hit which kind of sucks if you're playing as somebody who has a straight shot sort of final smash or abilities so, I think what we'll go with is the um, Jungle Japes from um, first introduced, I believe, in Melee. So we'll go with that. And uh, now there are many songs here that many people would go through, though. So <clears throat> the um, original DK theme from the arcade has permanently caused me psychological issues and will have left permanent trauma for the rest of my life simply because of the one time my buddy decided to pick the old school Donkey Kong level and pretty much it was just constant death just from the level. Not really the people that I was fighting because I'm pretty capable but just from the level itself which many of us and probably you as well who have also played Super Smash Brothers have dubbed level death kill. So, I could go with DK Rap, but that may end up driving me nuts after a while. I kind of like the, the kind of like craziness of Mole Patrol. So we'll go with that one. Now, before I was playing my NES versus Mewtwo battle, several of these videos are essentially back to back. So, we're going to go ahead and take him out, but we're also going to add in my, uh, triple threat so this time I'm going back to uh, my buddy Link and um, we also have to definitely throw in Donkey Kong into this battle I'm not really a big fan of adding Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong into a fight simultaneously I like kind of mixing it up and for some reason I kind of feel like throwing Duck Hunt in and um, I gotta make sure I say that Duck Hunt Okay, because I don't want this to sound the wrong way. Anyways, so put in duck hunt. Duck hunt. Put the put the pause in between the words. Okay, anyway, so we have duck hunt. And we're going to kind of change his um, scheme here, I think. I kind of like the... I kind of like this look, so we'll go with that. And then... I kind of like the idea of giving like Donkey Kong a different look. Um, I kind of like the gold hair look, but part of me likes the um, silver, like he aged quite a bit. But no, I can't really go with an aged Donkey Kong with that freaking uh, smirk on his face. But you know what? Screw it. We'll go with that. Now, typically I play as this Link, but. I'm also prone to the OG um, Link costume, which I'm pretty sure this is the Breath of the Wild version. This is like the, I think, the Royal Guard 
version, Fierce Deity. Um, you know what? I don't. I guess that one's also one of the Royal Guard versions. And then you got like I, I really couldn't even say where that one comes from. They must have just made it up. This one is another version, I guess, of the Royal Guard. And then we got Dark Link. Now, I'm kind of pissed off because one of the links that I always liked playing as in Melee was the link that had kind of a, like, like, I wouldn't say like white, it, like kind of like a whitish, like semi-purple hue to it, which kind of like, to me, felt like, you know, glory days or like the basically champion version of Link. But currently, the only champion version we have is this one. Um, but I think we'll go with the OG look. So, I don't know how long I took given a freaking history lesson right there of things that I enjoyed doing back in the heyday of Melee. Alright. Let's take a vote on guessing which character is going to be more annoying. Well, I kind of am not aggravated with Donkey Kong for being the first one to hit me. Because, like, he's an OG character, so I let him make it. And, and I just managed to pull that off, so... I thought I could have grabbed that, but maybe I just did it wrong. Talking about these, the difference between melee and this is the freaking bombs. And I have a big problem with these remote bombs. I mean, I managed to learn how to use them, but at the same time, it's like, if you don't hit the person with them, then it's like freaking floating around for a while, and you just might as well just you know, blow it up for the simple sake that it's pretty much entered its completely useless space. And I have a very, very strong belief here that the person that's going to piss me off the most, oh geez. Okay, there I am. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Well, that was bound to happen. I was kind of hoping he would have gone after, uh, you know. I'm just going to say dog and bird, okay? Because I'm not getting in trouble for saying a certain word because they had to put those two animal names right next to each other. So dog and, and bird are um, probably going to be the more annoying ones. You know, what's one of the things that I miss the most about the OG um, Smash Brothers is the fan. I mean, it was kind of like annoying and it made you think like, this thing doesn't really do anything. But trust me, I enjoy it. Looking back, I kind of wish they would have brought it back. But, well, I got rid of him, so I still have to pay Donkey Kong back for freaking final smashing me. I'm not mad at him, it's just principle. And then this, you see, I told you it was going to piss me off. Okay. Get off of me. I'm trying to get my revenge. Okay. Damn it. Ah, now it's really on. It's like, I'm still not pissed off at him. Like, he hasn't pissed me off. It's just like, you got into, like, insulting my honor. Like, it's not rage. It's just like... Honor must be... Honor must be reclaimed. How the hell did I miss him? Well, dead now. He's still alive. Yeah. So 
Somebody's gonna end up blowing something up. There we go. Well, Doggo and Kazooie die already? I mean, get off of me. He's saying F word. Oh well, we'll bleep it out in post production. I don't know what words I am allowed to say. Kind of just blanked out in the middle of reading the uh, YouTube. In terms of, you see, I already don't know how the rest of that ends because that's how quickly I blanked out. So, anyways. I kind of miss a number of other abilities that Link used to have back in the old heyday. Like even in uh, Brawl, which like everybody hates for not being melee, one of the few that I've ever actually uh, put enough time in to after melee because I had nothing really to do at all with Smash 4. But anyways, one of the things that I miss is that um, final Smash that Link has, or had, back then. He's probably gonna end up getting that. That was, that was bound to happen. Anyways, I like that Triforce Slash move. That, uh, was his final Smash? And then, you know, in the, um... The, uh... Toon Link and, and Kid Link still have the move, but they took it away from me and gave me that Ancient Arrow Blast, which, really honestly, unless the person you're firing at has a decent amount of damage on them, it does jack sh**. But, we'll get more on that in the future when I continue my gripes about how Melee was the pinnacle of Super Smash Brothers with Ultimate being like a close second. I don't even put Smash 64 in like a ranking system because it's just the OG and you don't even put the OG in like ranking. It is the OG Smash. You just put it in that like not, on, not just honorable mention category, but like in a realm that you just don't even touch because this is the game that made all of this possible. Anyways, thanks for watching this video. There'll be more in the future. Y'all have a good night and a good day.